Chapter 4. Wasn't Ravi enough? Jesus' radical emptying of church filth. The hedged walls of the church maze that we're leaving are constructed and deeply rooted by denominational distinctives that often pass under our radars. They circumvent our best discernments due to the popular assumption that because a ministry team leads a large church or has a large social media following, what they are teaching must be true. This popular notion of numbers validating authenticity prevails in all denominations, despite the fact that the Bible warns us of the increasing prevalence of wolves in sheep's clothing as the return of Jesus draws nearer. Today, the maze-like ensnaring effect of Christian denomination is that many good people of sincere faith honestly believe that remaining within compromised forms and systems of Christianity is virtuous. With their cowardly church leaderships which never say anything about abortion, marriage or transgenderism. People, probably like you, think that it's a question of finding the best place, the best compromise on the denominational spectrum or that, like a snooker scoreboard that can be easily changed when needed, we think that our relationship with other parts of the church are just a question of a tweak here and a tweak there. But the exit from this de-radicalizing maze of deception, constructed by God to bring us to our knees, will only be realized when we literally burn the roots of our church compromise. Spiritual violence and humility combined are the ignitable elements.